welcome to the hot and spicy baby how are you doing okay a few new products today <laughs> talking like it's a shave um firstly thank you so much for giving me the heads up you know who you are on this curry and we're using as you can see in the title marks and spencers the hot one curry new release made with fiery naga chilies and it's got char grilled chicken um here's a clip of the container we're half through, halfway through cooking char grilled chicken and look at the onion beautiful it looks and smells absolutely divine so i'm just stirring it up and putting it back for the rest of the cook right so that's that we've got some rice yes they're separate bowls we've got some poppadoms and while i was in marks and spencers i think was it no sorry mrs h bought this it's uh, gino de campo the italian chef this is his flatbread um garlic and mozzarella and something garlic roasted garlic isn't it? i'll give that a try actually Mmm. Mmm. Wow. That's nice. And then we're in North Wales. I'm gonna try this uh you can see that. It's called Clogwin Gold, Golden Hoppy Ale. Oh it's not too hoppy. From the Conway Brewery. And it is a how much is it? Four percent, I think. Just bear with four percent, are we? Let's just say there somewhere. Well, just looking at it. Oh, it's, it's not that important, really, is it? Four percent, yeah. Four percent, and it's half a litre. Clogwin gold. So we'll get our special tool and we'll uh, see how we put, oh I've got a old fashioned glass here, one of these pint glasses. So how's the old uh, weekend started off for you? Give it a try, shall we? Cheers. Can you hear that? Wow, that's quite nice. Got a citrusy taste of that. That's lovely. Real ale. Oh, that's lovely, that. Wow. Just over a pint. Ice cold. <laughs> right, come on, let's get going. Here it is. I'm not sure how hot it is, anything like that. So um, let's try a bit of chicken. Lovely, huge bits of chicken. And it looks absolutely stunning, like a homemade curry, actually. It's about four pounds to buy. There was a meal deal for four quid. Oh, lovely chicken. That's the best chicken in any curry I've had from a shop. Nice kick to that. Lady in the shop said, um, Oh, my husband loves... They always tell me that people are Serbian. Once had a boyfriend tried in screaming or something. But this lady said, lovely people, she said, her husband likes hot curries, and he, he tried this, and it was too much for him. So I'm not sure what the reason is, I don't know what he classes as hot, look at that. It's beautiful. That's the chicken.
Wow. There's a nice kick to it. Oh, that, that, the taste of the sauce. That's the nicest shop bought out of all of them in taste. Because it's good quality chicken. And big pieces. Not a lot of them, but it's enough for the curry. Big pieces. But the spice and the curry itself tastes homemade, if that makes sense. The heat. Like a fresh chilli heat. Mm. That is nice. Wow. Well done, Marks and Spencers. Mm. That's beautiful. So what's on your menu this evening? Mm. Wasn't sure I'd enjoy that. Sorry, Foz, I have it. This. Absolutely beautiful. The deal on in Tesco. Four bottles for six pounds. Don't usually do it, but I thought I'd stuff it. Nah. Mm. Well done, Gino. No problem, eh? Eh? Mm. Wow. To be honest, if I have eaten this, and nobody said anything, I could be led to believe that was homemade. That bit of rice. Mm. Curry night. Highly recommended. It. It's a lovely heat. It's not a. It's a five chili mark on it, and it is hot, um, but it's it's lovely for me. It's just a nice tingle. It's a nice curry. Not doesn't blow my head off, but it's lovely. Hmm. Chicken, absolutely. Char grilled, beautiful. Mm. This is beautiful. Mm. It's um, garlic, mozzarella, um, chives, I think. Mm. No, there is a, no, to be fair, there's a lot of chicken. Wow, one, two, three, four, five left. And I've had about four, haven't I? Wow, that's amazed me. Mm. The other ch um, curries, I enjoy them. Um, Heat-wise, the others are slightly hotter. But... Um, this is the nicest tasting. It's hot, fantastic taste, and good chicken. Four pounds in money, so it should be a bit better, shouldn't it? Because the others are about two pounds each. But to be honest with you, you couldn't make that for four pounds. No way. Mm. 
This is only up the road. Well, up the road, Conway, what was it 30 miles, 40 miles? Away. I've never seen it. I don't know where the brewery is. Conway. Is it by the castle? Or is it just outside, maybe? <laughs> Sound like a. People years ago used to say, um, like your grandmother or your grandmother's friends, you know, that type of And you'd go shopping when I was a kid, and my grandmother, and she'd meet a friend, oh, excuse me, and she'd say, Oh, hello, oh, doesn't it feel like a Tuesday? Doesn't it feel like a Tuesday to you? Doesn't it feel like a Tuesday? Or something like that, and then she'd <laughs> what does Tuesday feel like? And then you go meet another one another day or something and and she said I went to see Barbara and I went on Thursday. No, wait a minute, it wasn't Thursday. No no I was, I had my hair done Thursday. I th it was Friday. And I went on fr no it wasn't Friday. Uh, I went, and you feel like saying who gives us monkeys when it was just tell the story, will you? <laughs> Have you ever had that? Just me then. That is lovely. Look, I don't know if you can see in the light, but uh, lovely. It is golden, golden ale, ice cold, beautiful. Absolutely stunning. Who needs to go out when you're eating damn good food like this with exceptional company? Look at that. You tell me you know. That'll make you hungry. Char grilled. We're hungry too. Mm. I'll be getting more of that. Absolutely. I hope it's not one of these one offs. Mm. Highly recommend this. I think she's got it from Aldi's. Little's. One of the supermarkets, um, Aldi's, I think. Wow, very nice. The mozzarella gives a lovely creaminess to it. But you still got the the sort of garlicky chives taste them mm. tomorrow oh. um no Sunday dinner hashtag what we're heading out um so, uh, well, there will be a dinner, but it's not going to be a Sunday roast dinner. There's no Lashento, sorry, um, Natalie. But I'm doing a, a gammon steak, sort of tea time, we call it, five o'clock-ish, when we get back. Well, I'll be back before then, but gammon steak, chips, homemade, and some peas. Maybe an egg on top of the gammon. We'll see about that. No, no pineapple. I don't do pineapple on it. <laughs> pineapple is for pudding. Egg is for <laughs> for dinner. That's how I like it. You up to much tomorrow? 
we've had some atrocious weather. Wow. Rain. Oh, blimey. Lovely fluffy rice. You can see that. Probably not. I'm amazed at the touches on this, like the onion. Beautiful. You may be able to tell I've had nothing to eat since probably 11 o'clock this morning. And to be fair, that carton when I bought it, I thought there's not a lot in there. Four quid. But to be fair, that's a good amount and good quality. And I'm now getting full every time. But what I, what I do is I don't waste it. I'll give it about 10, 15 minutes. Oh, hang on. 24 degrees is not that hot in here. Man, you these lights are now. But there's a nice kick to that. But it won't blow your socks off if you like your chilies. Um, really enjoyed it. I'll have that. I'll have that again. Be a nice in the week on that as well. Uh, yeah, give it 10 minutes, 15 minutes. And it'll be warm then and I'll just finish it off. It's just, you, you know, you need a break just uh, for a minute and then. But obviously, you can't do that in a video, can you? You can't just sit there. Give me 10 minutes, yeah? So how's your mum, are I? It, it doesn't work like that. <laughs> Talking to someone who'd been out. Oh, they'd been to some city. I can't remember where it was. On a stag do or something. Oh, that's a lovely tingle. Now, now I've stopped. After. Absolutely stunning. Anyway, went on this stag do or whatever it was, and uh, he ordered uh, a pint of, you know, beer, whatever it was. I'm not sure if it was a real ale or whatever it was. <laughs> Six pound fifty. He said, "You what? Six pound fifty." So I said, "Did you get it?" He said, "Well, I had to, yeah." He said, "I was dying for a drink, and I, where else could you go?" Six pound fifty. You might think, well, it's normal. But he isn't here. Yeah. The sauce is stunning. Thick sauce. Look at that. Beautiful. Anyway, is this going on? I'm sorry. Every time. Right on. You're good company, you see. I love doing these. Having a chat, good food, good beer. Lovely. Right. So, have a great weekend. Um, thanks again for pointing this out to me. You know who you are. Much appreciated. Um, and I'll see you in the morning on the other channel if you follow me on there. Um, but as I say, we're heading out tomorrow. I haven't filmed clips of the week on purpose. Because I'm filming where we're going tomorrow. So there'll be a video if we're back in time. Hopefully tomorrow evening sometime. Um, but uh, if not then, it'll be Monday. But hopefully I'm going to aim for tomorrow evening um, and again hopefully it's an interesting video for you uh, I won't say what it is but uh, well you'll see tomorrow in here <laughs> so thanks a lot have a great weekend thanks again for your company for your chat and um, take care of yourselves and I'll see you hopefully yeah tomorrow night in this uh, 
little outing we're going on. So take care. Au revoir, as they say in Trevenant. <laughs> Lovely. Best shop bought curry ever. <laughs>